communication. All right, guys. Okay, so it's that time where you're gonna write to some females. To make your message stand out, it starts out with the subject title. Okay, we want to avoid the whole hi, hey, how are you, hello, beautiful. No, 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 no. Okay, we're going to pick a couple words or keywords that's going to make your message stand out. You want to write a catching or funny title so that she can click on there. Don't start off your email or write in your profile that you're new to this online dating thing, you're not sure why you're doing this, da da da, come on dude, you're on this already, so gung-ho about it, you know, go for it. And when you mention that, it kind of makes you seem like you're unsure why you're there and it's not a good way to start a message or a good way to show an impression. You don't have to start the email saying, hey, my name is fill in the blank, dot dot dot. No, no, you don't have to say that. When you write to her, make sure that you're referencing, referencing, Sorry, make sure that you're referencing something that she had written on her profile. So, for example, if she says she likes ice cream, then tell her, hey, you know, my favorite ice cream flavor is this. Have you tried that? It's always good to have a question in the email so that there's some sort of follow-up on her side to get back to you if she's interested, okay? These types of messages do not work. Hi, I think you're sexy. Sign, Dan. You know, that's not going to work because one, there's no follow-up, two, it's not interesting, three, we're going to assume that you probably cut and pasted that to 73 other chicks today. So you want to write a message that is short, that has some reference to what she has written in her profile, her personality, and also ask her a question so that she has something to write back to you. Vinay's rule of thumb. By the second or third message back and forth, you should move it to the next level, whether it be, hey, let's meet in person, hey, let's talk on the phone to get to know each other, see if there's any chemistry, that sort of thing. Because you do not want to do this email tag forever and ever. Because she's going to waste your time, you're going to waste your time. That's not what online dating is about. Online dating is not corresponding online forever. No, no, no. no. Online dating is for you to meet people from the online, this channel, and taking it to real life. I highly, highly, highly suggest talking on the phone with somebody um, before meeting somebody in person. Why? Because in the five to ten minutes you could talk on the phone, you can really know if there's any chemistry. It just adds more depth to that person. Would you get along with that person? Be intuitive. What does that mean? Pay attention to what she writes on her profile. Pay attention to what she said to you. After the first or second conversation, you should know if there's chemistry between you two. Ask her out. Something very casual and light for the first time. I would avoid the coffee thing, because why? Coffee is boring. Pay attention to your conversations and find out you know, what it is that she's interested in, whether she likes films or she likes you know, animals or she likes whatever, fill in the blank. Um, and then so you can kind of cater your date to be along those things. or New is always good. What does that mean? Is there a new museum in town? Is there a new restaurant? Is there a new dessert place? Is there a new film? Ask her if she wants to check it out. Just keep in mind, guys, that in the online dating world, it's similar to the real dating world in the sense that you're going to be exposed to a lot of people, but you're going to try to initiate with, with a few and within this, a percentage of those people, you're getting responses back. So have fun with this online dating thing. Contact people that you're attracted to that you find interesting. Start a conversation. Keep it light and fun. Don't present it like you're gonna you're online to find a serious relationship, and that's just a lot of pressure. Okay, keep it light and keep it fun. No sweat off your back if she doesn't reply to you. So I've helped a few of you guys with your online dating profiles, and I love 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 helping my friends with it. So, I can help you write a fantastic online dating profile and some photos. So, if you need some consulting, your girl Vinay is here for you. Just email me at avenay at gmail.com. The don'ts of online dating. Don't end a message and not leave a question or some sort of follow-up for her. Don't write LOL, he, 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 or any of that stuff on your profile. It makes you seem immature. <laughs> Don't make any racial kind of associations, okay? Like messages like, 
hey, Asian blah, or hey, hot Latina, like really, we don't appreciate that stuff and it's not gonna get you anywhere. Um, <laughs> I just find it funny when people like write messages like that. Yeah, don't do that. Don't write any douchebag messages either, okay? You know what I'm talking about, douchebag messages.